Hey guys, welcome to this week's episode of That Figures. I am Anthony. This is Collector's Entertainment Network. And we are going to continue opening up case packs from when I used to work at Target. First, I'd like to ask you to please like the video. Please subscribe to the channel. Love to have you back. And of course, please comment. I'd love to hear from you. And of course, please share this with anyone you think may like it as well. Okay. I've said it in other videos. I'll give you a quick recap. From about 2004 to 2007, I used to work at a Target. And I was a Star Wars collector. So when case packs came in, I would usually get the case pack. If it was a case pack of brand new figures, I would basically buy the whole thing and take the box. Sometimes it was a case pack of half new figures, half figures I didn't need. I would buy the figures I needed, but a lot of times I would take the box because it's a cool Hasbro case pack. Um, and sometimes it was three quarters I needed, whatever the case may be. So I have a lot of Hasbro case pack boxes. I lived in an apartment back then. I've lived in a few apartments, moved um, a number of times, but now my wife and I own our own house with our kids, of course, and we have an unfinished basement downstairs where all this stuff is stored. But eventually that unfinished basement, I want to have a finished collectibles room down there. So eventually these will see the light of day, but right now we are going to open this case pack that has probably not been opened for 15 years. It is not factory sealed. I obviously opened it when I bought them back in the day because you had to scan them and everything. But it has been sealed probably since close, you know, after that. And the sticker on it says Star Wars Vintage. So this is probably the vintage collection from, I don't know. Let's see if, we have, if I can find a date on here. Okay, I found a date. It is 5-20-06. I mean, that's just the target date of when it was received, but at least it gives us an idea of when it came out. It came out in 2006. All right, let's just get right into it, see what we've got in here. Again, not factory sealed, but they have been sealed for quite a long time, and I don't remember what's in here. So we're going to open these, open this. Got my clever cutter. And let's, there we go. Let's see what we have got. Okay, I've got them wrapped in, looks like Target bags. I think it's Target bags. Let's get this to open. It hasn't been opened and uh, cardboard is uh, strong. All right, so it is, so it's probably not the full case pack. There were probably doubles that or ones that I had previously gotten but let's see what we got okay these are not actually vintage collection let's see what this is these are the vintage collection so I'll quickly show you what I've got in this bag so you probably bought half the case the other case, case the other half was probably doubles so what I've got here is look at this Revenge of the Sith, Target exclusive, Utapau Shadow Trooper. So that is number one. And actually, let me show you the back. That's pretty cool. We have got... Is it another one? Oh, it's another one. I've got two of them. Utapau... Shadow Trooper Target Exclusive. And also in here, I have the coin, the Target Exclusive coin for Revenge of the Sith. Now, I think I bought this from somewhere else. Even though I was working at Target, I think I like the exclusive somewhere else. I don't remember what the exclusives were. Um, but I think I might have bought it at Walmart or Best Buy because I like the exclusive exclusives better. And if I remember correctly, a co-worker of mine bought the movie because they wanted the movie, but couldn't care less about the coin, so they just gave me the coin. Okay, so that is that. A little detour. So it is not a fresh case pack, officially, but these are, I can tell, Star Wars Vintage Collection. And I imagine, like I said, it's probably about half the case pack, and I just put other things in to seal it up. Oh, I've even got the receipt, which is faded, and I 
couldn't tell you. It's really faded. I can't tell you when I bought it. So, all right. Here is Greedo. Pretty cool. Vintage collection. There's a special offer. Oh, here is. Let's put that down there. Another Greedo. I guess I was buying doubles a lot back then. I don't know what the concept was. Maybe I wanted to open. I don't know. Saga collection. Here is a Biker Scout. Very cool. It says the Saga collection. But it's definitely vintage. Here is the back. Alrighty. Here we've got Luke in X-Wing outfit. There is the back. Got a couple more. Let's see what we've got. We've got... Tuscan Raider or Sand People as it says because that's what it would say back then and here is the back very cool and I've got one more and that is Han from Return of the Jedi in his Endor outfit and here is the back all right, so that is it. I'm going to be back next week. We're going to open another case. Let's see what's in there. Uh, so in this one, we had the Saga Collection and the Vintage Collection um, sort of design. And we also had a couple of Target exclusive from Revenge of the Sith, Utapau Shadow Troopers. All right, that's it for this week. I'm going to put all this back. I'll see you next week with another episode where we unbox another one. Maybe it's a full case pack. Maybe it's sort of a uh, mix of case packs that I put together. Who knows? It It's as much a surprise to me as it is to you. Okay. Again, please like, please comment, please share, and of course, please subscribe to the channel. I'd love to have you back. All right. That's it for this week. And until next week, have a good one.